femoral, the tibial femoral joint. Um, I'll need to do an anterior glide. And a good position is to have uh, weight on the foot. The body is the uh, counterbalance for the movement. And if I want to do a sustained grade 3, I find the um, find where the joint laxity is taken out of the joint and I'll apply more uh, anterior movement. I'll hold that for um, 8 to 10 seconds and release and come up to the um, elastic barrier and then into the elastic region holding that 8 to 10 seconds and release and come back up again 8 to 10 seconds and hold that and that will help to increase um, extension. Now if I want to increase flexion I can maintain the same position and apply a posterior glide and it's the same movement but opposite so I want to take it up to the elastic a barrier then into the elastic region, 8 to 10 seconds, bring it out again, and I can go to what's called a partial stop, which is uh, just at uh, sustain grade 2, and then back into a sustain grade 3, 8 to 10 seconds, and back to a sustain grade 2, and then back into a sustain grade 3. That's called a partial release.